you can now publish a game onto Roblox completely from a mobile device. As of literally just yesterday, you can upload games onto your profile, earn Robux, and get visits. So this is crazy. And how is this possible? Well, it's through a game called Studio Light. Studio Light is a game on Roblox that is a recreation of Roblox Studio. It's, uh, <laughs> it's actually pretty trippy. It's Roblox Studio inside of Roblox Studio. But anyways, it is accessible to mobile users. And as of just yesterday, they announced that through the use of API keys, you can now publish your Studio Light projects onto your actual Roblox profile. So this is wild. And in this video, I'm going to show you exactly how you can do this yourself. So of course, let's go open up Roblox on my so here we are on mobile and I'm on a new account as well. I'm going to be doing all of this on mobile and on a new account just to show that you can do all of this on mobile with an account that has never even touched a laptop or a PC at all. So here we go. First off, you're going to look up Studio Light. Let's go join the game. Check it out. <clears throat> All right, here we are, outputs open. And as you can see, this is just pretty much a complete replica of Roblox Studio. You can insert part, you can move the part, you can scale the part, you can, there you go. And it's a little bit hard to use. It's a little bit of a challenge, <laughs> but you know, you're on mobile. What'd you really expect here? I think this is pretty sick. I've actually made a video making a game on here before. If you want to check that out, it was definitely a challenge video <laughs> for sure. But you even have a little toolbox here. You know, you can insert your stuff, you can insert a tree. Whoa, look at that. <laughs> oh, they even got like sky boxes here. Let's try that out. Ooh, look at that. That's pretty beautiful. I like that. You're even able to, you know, uh, add in script fire smoke let's add in the script when you go to insert a script you even have a bunch of options for pre-made scripts if you want to add one and you can even scroll all the way down and insert a script with nothing in it if you want to code yourself which is not easy on mobile but you know good luck <laughs> let's uh let's, let's make this part tween in a circle and all the scripts come with comments that tell you exactly what everything does really cool let's uh let's press play see what happens here and it's <laughs> it's not anchored so that might be why it's moving no i think it's just sweet so let's uh let's press stop so as you can tell we have a beautiful game right here and if we go ahead and we click splash up at the top and we click play publish you can see all of the different games that have already been published from studio light onto these people's profiles these are all games that were made in studio light which is pretty cool you can teleport to them and check them out if you want we're not going to be doing that right now because we have our own game to make okay so let's go click file you know I'll, let's say i want to publish this beautiful game that i got going on right here i'm going to click save and these are all other games that I was testing with. I've actually had to record this video a couple of times just because of the screen recording on my phone. It keeps getting messed up, which isn't fun. Give this game a name. Okay, we'll just name it Tree because we have... And we need to add a description. We'll say uh, Big Tree. Okay, a little bit more descriptive in the description. <laughs> okay, now we're going to click the Publish option, okay? And this makes it, as it says right there, so that everyone can play it. This will essentially publish it to your profile. Click Save. And unfortunately, it is not quite that easy, okay? But don't worry. I'm going to walk you through it. Don't worry. We're going to do it. First off, it says replace. Basically what that means is that by clicking publish, you aren't creating a new game to your profile. You're actually saving the project that you've made inside of Studio Lite. You're saving it to an already existing game. So unfortunately, if you're on mobile, there is no way to create a new game onto your profile. But lucky for us, all users on Roblox come with their own place. So we can just publish it to there. And don't worry, you'll be able to change the title, the description, the thumbnail, everything like that later on. The next option is API key. The API key is what makes Make all of this work so now we're gonna have to go and create our own api key we're gonna click cancel and we're gonna leave out of studio now what you're gonna want to do is click more scroll down and click create and from here you're going to click the three lines up at the top left click open cloud click api keys okay so now you're gonna press create api key first off we got general information this is where you give it a name and a description the name and description don't really matter at all i'll just name it example and for the description you don't even need a description to be honest with you <laughs> It's optional but what you do need is to fill out access permissions okay you're going to select api system and you're going to scroll down and you're going to find universe places okay make sure you click on universe places click add api system and you're going to scroll down and select an experience so you're going to want to select the experience that you want to insert your studio light project into okay that's going to be my zionic alts please add experience then you're going to scroll down some more and select operations to add okay super simple you just click the one option that there is which is right there we go now you got to 
repeat this again, scroll back up to the top, click API systems, but this time you're gonna fill out for universe, okay? You're gonna click universe. Add API system, select experience, click the same experience, add experience, select operations to add. And this time you're gonna click both of the rights, okay? There's, there's two rights, make sure you select them both, okay? Scroll all the way down to security, okay? For this, this is super simple. You don't even need your IP address. You're just gonna enter in 0.0.0. .0 dot zero dot zero so <laughs> three dots four zeros slash zero okay and if that's a little too confusing you can always just go down right here and copy this that's easier for you as it says right there that note that that indicates that there is no ip protection for the api key just don't worry about it <laughs> uh just make sure you click add api address and we're all set so we can scroll down save and generate key click it and boom we got this big <laughs> big thing of random letters symbols and everything and we're gonna copy it to clipboard that is our api key right there make sure that you copy it okay should be on your clipboard as you x out of there go back to studio light where we're gonna join back into our studio light game of course oh no <laughs> where'd our project go don't worry don't worry don't worry just gotta open it back up tree <laughs> tree <laughs> this is an awful game we're gonna click file again but this time we're gonna click save tree save again make sure that you select the game that you want to insert all of this into and we'll select that and now you're gonna paste your api key right here i don't know why that keeps happening my phone is just bugging out <laughs> i have to turn it sideways for this paste okay all that random jumble of letters it's all in there and now we click publish boom publish finishing publish finishing and success there we go we now have a game uploaded onto roblox studio all from mobile this is sweet okay let's exit out of here let's go check it out so now we're gonna go to our profile let's go to our profile view full profile creations and tree <laughs> there it is big tree hey we can uh we can join the game all of our progress that we made in studio light should be in there um there it is there's our spinning <laughs> i'm sure you guys will be able to create something a little bit more impressive than this and spend a little bit more time on it but just like that we've we uploaded a game and if you want to go ahead and you want to change the title of the game or the description anything like that you're just gonna exit out of here go over to create and from here you're able to manage your experience you know change the name ever and everything you can view your analytics check out you know how many players you're getting stuff like that engagement charts and all that good stuff and yeah there you go this is a lot different of a video than i usually do but this was just something really cool i wanted to cover make sure more people find out about this and yeah go create a new game on mobile check it out and check out the video where i create my own game in studio light it should be popping up on the screen right now see you in the next one